clarification, something to the terms of abortion and kind of your stance on that. And when it comes to rape, it sounded like you said something to the effect of if you have a child because you were raped, it was God's intention to still have that. How, is that what you said? What I said was, in answering the question from my position of faith, I said that I believe God creates life. And God, oh God, and I believe that as holy and as fully as I can believe that God creates life. And so even if that happens in a rape situation, you still firmly believe that to be true? That God creates life? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, God is the only one that can create life. You said, I think, this is a quote, I think even when life begins in that horrible situation of rape, that is something that God intended to happen. The life would be created. God that created life specifically? Life. Pardon? That life specifically? Yes, I think God creates every life. That life was created because of rape. How can you? That, no, 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 no. How can you divorce? No, 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 no. God creates life. God creates life. We don't make life, um, uh, you know, in a machine. God creates life. It is as simple as that. And God creates life. Does God want people raped? Of course not. But you, but you believe that abortion should be outlawed in even in cases of rape. Yes, that is correct. W incest too? What, what I said, again, I've, I've said that consistently, that the only case where I think abortion is appropriate is life of the mother. Okay. And I've said that for a long, long time. 